next video is on binomial distribution and this is from probability distribution. See here the question is two dice are thrown five times. How many dice are thrown? Two dice are thrown five times. Find the probability of getting seven as sum. See here getting seven as sum at least once two times and probability of one less than x less than five. See First one, P is nothing but the probability of getting 7 as sum when two dice are thrown. Probability of probability of getting 7 as sum when two dice are thrown. So, what are the chances of getting sum as 7 when two dice are thrown? First, on the first die if it's 1, so, in order to make it 7, it should be 6. And next one, it is 6, 1. And next 2, comma for 7. On the second die, it should be 5. And next one, 5, comma 2. And next 3, comma 4. And similarly, 4, comma 3. So, if you add up all these numbers, we will be getting 7 as sum when 2 dice are thrown simultaneously. Therefore, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. There are 6 chances of getting Sum as 7 when 2 dice are thrown. Therefore, P is equal to 7 by 36. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Only 6. 6 by 36. So, if I cancel, this will be 1 by 6. Therefore, the probability of getting 7 as sum when 2 dice are thrown is P is equal to 1 by 6. So, we have Q as Q is equal to the probability of not getting 7 as sum not getting 7 as a sum when two dice are thrown is see here we have p plus q is equal to 1 and p is 1 by 6 plus q is equal to 1 and q will be 1 minus 1 by 6 q value is if i take 6 as lcm this is 6 minus 1 q is equal to this is 5 by 6 we got q as 5 by 6 and see coming to this question two dice are thrown for how many times five times here n value is equal to 5 and find the probability of getting 7 as sum at least once see here at least at least once means maximum for five times so for the first so here n is equal to 5 and see P is equal to what is our value of P and Q. So just now we found P is equal to 1 by 6 and Q is equal to 5 by 6. And see P value is equal to 1 by 6 and Q value is 5 by 6. And now we have to find out solution 1. Solution 1 is for at least at least once. At least once means, see here, minimum one, maximum for five times. See here, we have total probability. That is probability of x is equal to 0 plus x is equal to 1 plus probability of x is equal to 2 plus probability of x is equal to 3 and C plus probability of x is equal to 4 plus total probability of x is equal to 5. As the n value is equal to 5, there are 5 chances. The total probability is equal to 1. So, at least 1 means, what is the meaning of at least 1? That is probability of x greater than or equal to 1. It means we have to calculate from x is equal to 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5. In order to calculate all these, I am calculating 1 minus p of x is equal to 0. Therefore, probability of x greater than 1 is equal to 1 minus probability of x is equal to 0. See here. Now, I am going to substitute. So, what is the formula for the binomial distribution? p of x is equal to r means n c r p power r and this is q power n minus r. Now, we have to substitute here all the values. So, here n is equal to 5, p is equal to 1 by 6 and q is equal to 5 by 6. Now, if I substitute all the values, then see, this will be 1 minus n c 5, n c r, r value is equal to 0. n is nothing but 5 c 0 and what is our p value? 
P is equal to 1 by 6 power R. What is our R? R is equal to 0. And Q, Q is equal to this is 5 by 6. This is 5 by 6 power N minus R. So this value is 1 minus 5C naught is 1. 1 by 6 power 0. And this is 5 by 6 power 5. And therefore, anything to the power of 0 is 1. So this will be 5 by 6 power 5. So this is at least getting some as 7 for at least once is the value here is 1 minus 5 by 6 power 5. And the next one solution 2. So what is our question 2? Question 2 is nothing but getting find the probability of getting 7 as 7 for 2 times. Here it is very clear in the statement that so we have to get sum as 7 for 2 times. Solution 2. 2 times here r value is rightly 2 and therefore n is equal to 5. So here n is equal to 5 and we have p is equal to 1 by 6. Q is equal to 5 by 6 and R value is equal to 2 here. So, we have a probability binomial distribution formulae that is probability of X is equal to R is equal to NCR. This is P power R. Then this is Q power N minus R. Now, if I substitute here, then this will be probability of X is equal to 2 is equal to what is N? N is equal to this is 5C2. P is equal to 1 by 6 power R2 and Q is equal to 5 by 6 power N minus R that is 5 minus 2. What is 5C2? The difference here is 5 into 4. 2 times backward step and 2 times front or else NCR is equal to N factorial by N minus R factorial into R factorial. So this is 1 by 6 square and this is 5 by 6 power 4 and see 5, 2, 0, 3. So, this value is 3. And see, if I cancel in 2 table, this will be 5, 2, 0, 10, 1 by 6 square. And this is 5 by 6 cube. So, this value is 10 times. This is 5 power. 2 plus 3. This value is 5. So, this is uh, 5 cube. This is 5 cube. 6, power, 6 square plus 6 cube. This is 6 power 5. And... Uh, see here and therefore the probability of getting 7SM when two coins are uh, thrown for two times is 10 into this is 5 cube into this is 6 power 5. So this is the answer and next one coming to the third question that is probability of 1 less than x less than 5. See here solution 3 is Solution 3 is nothing but, solution 3 is uh, nothing but probability of 1 less than x less than 5. Which means, see here, x is greater than 1. That is probability of x is equal to 2 plus probability of x is equal to 3 plus probability of x is equal to 4. So, the x value is less than 5 until 4 we have to calculate. So, again we have n is equal to, see our n value is equal to 5 and p value is equal to 1 by 6 and q is equal to 5 by 6 and here r value is equal to 2, here 3 and here 4. And we have again the formula I am writing that is probability of x is equal to r is nothing but ncr p power r and this is q power n minus r. If I substitute the probability of uh, x is equal to 2 is nothing but n. What is the value of n? That is a 6 c 2 p. What is p here? That is 1 by 6 square power r and q power this is n minus r that is 5 minus 2 plus and the next one is for probability of x is equal to 3 n c r p power r and next this is q power that is 5 by 6 power n minus r that is 5 minus 3 and next for n is uh, x is equal to 4 see here that is n c r p power r and this is q power n minus r now this will be what is 5 c 2 that is see here 5 c 2 5C2 is nothing but 2 backward steps that is 
फाइव इंटू फोर बाई वन इंटू टू दिस इज वन बै सिक्स स्क्वेर दिस इज फाइव बै सिक्स क्यूब एंड नेक्स्ट वन फाइव इंटू सी हियर थ्री बैकवर्ड स्टेप दट इज फाइव इंटू फोर इंटू थ्री बाय वन इंटू टू इंटू थ्री एंड नेक्स्ट वन बै सिक्स क्यूब इंटू दिस वन इज फाइव बै सिक्स स्क्वेर एंड द नेक्स्ट वन हियर इज फाइव सी फोर फाइव सी फोर फोर बैक स्टेप दट इज फाइव इंटू फोर इंटू थ्री इंटू टू बाय वन इंटू टू इंटू थ्री इंटू फोर इंटू दिस इज वन बै सिक्स पार फोर एंड दिस इज फाइव बाई सिक्स पार वन so if i cancel sorry if i cancel in two table so this will be 5 this is 5 to the 10 1 by 6 square and this is 5 by 6 cube and next one see 3 we can cancel and this is 2 again 5 to the 10 1 by 6 cube into this value is 5 by 6 square See here, three three we can cancel, four four we can cancel, and we got the value as five into. Um, so this value is one by six power four and five by six power one, and see here, this value will be ten into. So this is five q by six power five plus ten times of. So this value is five square into six power divided by six power five. And this is five into five by this is a six par five. And see if I take one by six par five common, this is ten into five cube. This is one twenty five. This is ten into see here twenty five five square twenty five. And this value is five into five. And see this value is one by six par five. This is one thousand two hundred and fifty. And this is two fifty, and this value is twenty five. And see here, this is fifteen twenty five by this is a six par five. So if I use calculate the value here is one nine six one one six two five one. So this is the final answer. So this is how we have to solve. And thank you so much for watching. This is also so easy if you follow these steps. And please pass it on to your friends if you really like and subscribe to this channel.